Okay, so again, I'm sorry about this lighting. It's just going to be how it is. Um, I'm definitely not saying keep supporting her, becoming members, um, super chatting her, anything like that. I'm definitely not saying that. I'm saying just don't blame her as somebody who can never get cleaner. So, like, just don't deem her as, you know what I mean, as somebody who can't do it. Um, if everybody gave up on me, which a lot of people did, like, everybody needs somebody, at least one person, to believe in them. That's all I'm trying to do. That's all I'm trying to say. Um, I really hope nobody stops following me just because I said, let's just not give up on her on the fact that there is still a chance she could get clean someday. I understand her issues are, you know, there's layers and she's going to need therapy. Um, I'm just saying don't say she'll never, ever, ever get clean or sober because people said that about me. And it hurt. And look where I am now. I'm four years sober and I'm a badass mom. <laughs> so, um, and I'm, I'm doing the dang thing. So, well, I'm not saying financially support her. I'm just saying don't kick her to the curb and deem her as somebody who's never going to do anything in life to get clean or sober because it could happen. It could. You just have to hit rock bottom like me. I hit rock bottom. Thank you guys. I hope you understand what I'm saying. Um, I really, really got to get ready now. Bye.